Worldwide, millions of deaths ascribed to malaria are still being recorded. The disease, a huge burden to Africa, continues to cripple the economic development in the region. In Nigeria, malaria is responsible for 60% outpatient visits to health facilities, 30% childhood deaths, 25% of death in children under one, and 11% maternal deaths. For this reason, the Cross River State Government is reaching out to various communities to sensitize residents on the need to cultivate personal hygiene and prevent malaria infection. Bogobiri community is one latest beneficiary of the government's efforts. The DG reached out telling the people about the Ayadecare health insurance law, with nets also distributed to women in each compound. We want them to buy into Ayadecare, which is a new form of health insurance that would provide quality health care for them. We equally want them to use the bed nets which we have provided for them to ensure that they can protect themselves and their children from mosquito bites and from coming down, of course, with malaria. Beneficiaries thank government for the gesture, what they believe was timely. I will use it because to maintain my children, you know, so that I will take care of my children because of the mosquito bites. This one has been so unique, directly from the government, facing the community particularly. So it is so unique, that's why it makes it so wonderful. For the first day for the salah, and the first okay. dash, give, men and give us for the salah, please. The battle against malaria is a constant one, and through this sensitization campaign, the Cross River State Government is making a statement that it is up to the task.